As seen here, Snapchat has made the biggest leap in this category compared to the rest of the world. Which Snap attributes to its investment in local content and improved language support. While its biggest Android update, launching in 2019, has also helped strengthen its presence in India, where it is currently experiencing steady growth. In terms of engagement, Snapchat claims that more than 200 million of its users use its augmented reality tools every day. While its latest viral effect, where users can become anime characters, produced a billion impressions in the first three days after its launch. Snapchat released its latest earnings report, which shows strong revenue growth in Q4 2020 and strong growth in active users during that period. Snapchat has already partnered with Jordan, Ralph Lauren and Levi's for similar integrations, but expanding this program would bring a new set of sponsored apparel options to the app and allow the brands to connect with users in a whole new way. Snapchat also says the TikTok clone spotlight, which launched in November and comes with the added attraction of for its best performances, each day has been well received, with more than 100 million active users each month in January. Snap also wants to go digital. A patent published last month describes a new process that allows users to wear their Bitmoji avatars in the latest fashion. Interestingly, it also allows Snapchat to reach an older audience, as the total time spent daily by Snapchat users over 35 years on shows produced by publishers in content increased by more than 30% year after year. Snapchat's current direction is very exciting, and its steady growth in usage and engagement suggests a number of opportunities for advertisers looking to reach younger audiences. As you can see, most of Snap's revenue still comes from North America, but this could point to more opportunities for expansion as markets in Europe and the rest of the world approach. It's always strange for Snapchat to duplicate the functionality of another app usually the other way around but, as mentioned above, daily payments are a big attraction for some developers, some of whom generate solid revenue from their spotlight clips. It makes sense, of course, but it has been shown that as Snapchat users get older, they give up, not stay. Snap is now investing in a new programming cycle to strengthen its discover platform in an effort to redefine episodic content for the next generation of consumers. A record 97 new international discover channels were also launched in the fourth quarter. Part of Snapchat's big pushes user engagement and retention. In terms of revenue, Snapchat's total revenue for the quarter grew 62% year over year to 911 million. First, Snapchat added 16 million daily active users during the quarter, reaching a new record of 265 million ADUs. Snapchat's original programs proved to be a big achievement for the company, many of which now see an average of tens of millions of people.